so dear children in today's video we are going to see uses of computer networks before that we know that a computer network is a system where computers are connected to share information different kinds of computers are interconnected to communicate with each other so the networking is a very very important part in the world of information technology so today we will see the uses of computer networks let's start uses of computer networks we know that computer networks support a large number of applications and services we are going to access to world wide web digital videos audios and the use of shared application which are very very famous in today's era and the storage servers which provide a huge amount of data to be stored easily printers machines scanners and different devices are easily going to be connected in a network the use of electronic mail and instant messaging applications as well as many others so one by one we will see it computer networks have become invaluable to organization as well as individuals friends we cannot imagine our world without computer networks the very famous is there the information information needs to be shared whenever demanded information is a such a useful data which is very very important for any organization like for example if we consider the example of school students information is very important asset for this institute so computer networks allow organizations having units which are placed apart from each other like we use computer network to exchange information with the people who are living far apart from each other a person can view an online document and can make changes whenever required so programs are there softwares in any computer can be accessed by other links which are connected in a network so like for example if you are in a internet cafe and you want to give a print option so you can give it and the main printer is attached to the server which can be easily shared among the different clients those who are there in present in a cafe so different peripheral devices are easily available for the varied users the next and the very important part without which we cannot imagine today's world e-commerce e stands for electronic so computer networks have paved a way for a variety of business and commercial transactions in today's era that is of covid-19 it's very hard to go outside and buy some products so what we are doing we are performing our online activities all over the digital world through the means of electronic commerce by sitting at home users can pay their bills they can buy they can sell items they can manage their bank accounts they can visit the websites they can pay the taxes they can transfer the funds and handle it all the digital the currency is now electronic so all the investments are made electronically so e-commerce has made a lot of time and efforts to a very limited and a portable means at a one place wherever the users are available so next is what retrieving remote information retrieving is very important the retrieval or the access to the data or the information which is useful data through the networks on a variety of topic like for example by sitting at a home students can search any topic from the internet and can make their own projects they can make their own assignments so the informations are stored around different databases which are remote databases so user can gain all the information 
and these information systems are easily available like which we are using nowadays www world wide web you can connect to it and you can easily get search engines connected and the information will be available within the seconds next is speedy interpersonal communication the world is itself is a speedy so computer network cells also increased the speed and volume of the communication like we have never before so electronic mails we can easily send a text we can do the mail merge options we can send online documents we can edit them by sitting at our homes images videos online filling forms online scheduling and reservation so many applications are there which can transfer your personal data effectively and that also reliable so online communications have increased the main fold times through social networking services which have made the world so much closer the next is high reliable highly reliable system the main use of computer network is high reliability how let's see it the copy of a document can be made available on many machines so if suppose one of the system is not available maybe due to some hardware failure maybe some technical problems so the other copies stored on the computer could be used so this is nothing but the system is highly reliable so failure occurs in one source does not going to affect the working of the whole system means user valid user can collect the data from the other system whenever demanded so reliability is a very very important in a network the next is cost effective system so here cost effective everyone wants their applications to be cost effective like a software program installed in one system can be used by other computer systems which are connected in the network so what happen here here you can save your money how by just eliminating the need to buy several copies of one software program therefore you can easily get reduction in the cost so computer networks have the reduced cost of establishment of computer system in an organizations along with the advent of networks means it is very sufficient to set up some personal computers for the same purpose and no need to buy a different different software copies once it is shared in the network the software can be accessed by the different pcs so these are important uses of computer networks hope you have understood it